Unlocking the Mysteries of the Night Sky, The Waning Gibbous Moon. Hello, dear viewers. Today, we're going to embark on a fascinating journey through the night sky as we explore the waning gibbous moon. Whether you're a budding astronomer, an English language learner, or simply curious about the celestial wonders, you're in the right place. Understanding the moon's phases can be a magical experience, and today, we'll unravel the mystery behind one of its most intriguing stages. So, let's dive in and illuminate the secrets of the waning gibbous moon together. Before we delve into the specifics of the waning gibbous moon, let's first understand the basics of the moon's phases. The moon goes through a series of changes in appearance called phases. These phases are the result of the moon's orbit around the Earth, and how different portions of the moon are illuminated by the sun. The primary phases include the new moon, first quarter, full moon, and last quarter. Between these major phases, there are several intermediate stages, and the waning gibbous moon is one of them. The term waning gibbous moon refers to the phase following the full moon. During this phase, the illumination of the moon decreases from 100% to around 50%. The word, waning, means decreasing or diminishing in size, indicating that the visible part of the moon is getting smaller. Gibbous, refers to the shape of the moon when more than half but not all of the moon is illuminated. During the waning gibbous phase, the moon rises later each night and appears in the sky after sunset. This phase is a time of reflection, decrease, and letting go, often symbolizing the process of transformation and preparation for new beginnings. To observe the waning gibbous moon, you don't need any special equipment. Just a clear night sky and a little bit of patience. Look towards the eastern horizon after sunset, and you'll likely catch a glimpse of this diminishing but still brightly illuminated moon. Each night, the moon will rise approximately an hour later, making it visible later in the night and into the early morning hours. Observing the moon's phases, especially the waning gibbous, can be a rewarding experience, offering insights into the moon's cycle and its impact on the natural world, including the tides and wildlife behavior. Beyond its scientific explanation, the waning gibbous moon holds cultural and symbolic significance in various traditions around the world. It's often associated with gratitude, sharing, and evaluation. This phase of the moon is a time to give thanks for the abundance the full moon symbolizes and to share that abundance with others. It's also a period for self-reflection, letting go of negative energies, and preparing for the renewal that the new moon brings. We hope this journey through the night sky to explore the waning gibbous moon has been enlightening. Understanding the moon's phases not only enhances our appreciation of the natural world but also connects us with the rhythms of the universe. Remember, each phase of the moon carries its own beauty and significance. So, the next time you gaze up at the night sky, take a moment to marvel at the waning gibbous moon, reflecting on the cycles of change and renewal it represents. Thank you for joining us on this celestial adventure. Until next time, Keep looking up and keep learning.